We celebrate our seven school board members each January for their contributions to Leander ISD. Pandemic or not, this year is no different. After all, we are better together, even if we're virtual. But what is a trustee? What do they do? We asked a few students to share. I think the Leander ISD school board maybe schedules a lot of the stuff for teachers. It says when kids can have days off and half days. I think the school board helps what they spend the money on. It helps with the school safety in the cafeteria. To track of the rules to provide local citizens with education. I think they are the ones who like set up all of our school stuff and keep the safety rules in place so we are all safe. Kind of regulating what's going on and making sure every, everything goes well. And I think they just kind of like manage it, kind of. And I like create the best environment for studying and learning. They go to schools and make sure the schools are running good. They also work with Dr. Geering and other district members to keep LISD as one of the strongest school districts in the state of Texas. Thanks, Leander ISD students. Our trustees serve at large, which means all seven represent that entire 200 square miles of our district, not just one region. They are elected every four years in phases, with three or four trustees up for re-election every two years. In place one, we have our board president, Trish Bodie, an experienced advocate for public education across our state. Trish prides herself as a strong communicator focused on relationship building, which is how she leads on the board as its president. Trish brings well-rounded experiences from her home to the boardroom and to the state capitol. In place two, Dr. Gloria Gonzalez Dolakia serves as our board's vice president. A parent of three sons, including one who graduated last year, Gloria has fought to address equity and accessibility during her time on the board. A continuation of her work as a volunteer and former executive director of the Leander ISD Educational Excellence Foundation, known as LEAP. Place 3 trustee is new to our board of trustees, but not new to Leander ISD. Christine Maurer has worked for the district as an instructional assistant, a volunteer for programs like Math Pentathlon and the Marching Band. She has sons in middle and high school, as well as a recent graduate. Place 4 trustee Anna Smith took to the board in November after years serving in PTA volunteer positions, including as the president of the LISD Council of PTAs. A parent of kids at elementary, middle, and high school, Anna is passionate about public schools and inclusivity for all kids with all capabilities. Trustee Jim McKay is serving in our Place 5 for his second term. Jim brings his experiences as a first responder and member of our nation's military to our board, as well as being a parent of two LISD graduates. Jim champions in bringing everyone a voice in their experience with the district and our schools. Place 6 holds our most experienced trustee in Aaron Johnson, serving since 2011 focused on maximizing the district's resources for all students. He's also a parent of four LISD students, including another recent graduate, as well as a tech executive working in Austin for more than 20 years. Alexis Grimes brings compassion and heart to our Place 7 seat, also serving as our board secretary. Alexis seeks equity and responsibility from our district to honor the voice and choice of families and taxpayers in our public schools. She's a mom to an LISD graduate and current middle school student, which keeps her mindful of the past and looking to the future. We started the year with community conversations about hopes, dreams, race, and equity. We were going full throttle into transformation for our students, including the board's approval to expand pre-K to full day, increase the amount of special education teachers in our schools, and reduce elementary school class sizes. Then the pandemic hit. We shut our buildings down and took to Zoom. 
Our board continued to lead making the tough decisions, taking care of our staff by continuing to pay all employees, and considering our students' realities by temporarily adjusting the grading policy. We celebrated our kids and staff in new ways. Graduation looked different, but our board's resilience in celebrating student success continued. We launched a school year, adjusted, reviewed, adjusted again, and kept moving forward in the most challenging year for public education. The decisions and discussions were rarely easy or short, but the work for kids kept happening. To close the year, we said goodbye to our two longest standing board members who left behind legacies for service to Leander ISD. And we welcome two new board members to our team of eight. It was never easy, but it was always focused on what's best for kids and families. Board service is a volunteer effort accepted by only a few in the community. It is a tough job with no salary. It is a critically important job that requires an election and then mandated training it is a responsibility that takes time, a mature outlook, and careful decision making. Take a moment to recognize your local trustees. Take a moment to honor the work they are doing to help your students sail into the future. Thank you, Leonard. I